Hello, Internet. I'm back with some more SevTech Ages Minecraft. Uh, let's get into it. Tip number 12, you can move faster in certain blocks like grass paths. Which is when you take a shovel and you right-click on the dirt. been a minute since I last did this, um, but I've been watching lots of other YouTubers and streamers play SevTech, and <laughs> I have a ways to go to get to where they are, but uh, the goal for today, as indicated by the title, is to get to totem stuff, totemic stuff. So, still gonna need to do uh, some murder to get leather and bones and stuff. Let's see, letting things load in. Okay, so I've got that. Uh, Totemus drum. I need planks and leather. Which I could make. Um, did I need... Okay, what was I doing? I think I have resin and the salt for the hide, and also flour for dough. And I've got so many seeds. Okay, I have the one chime. I need the drums. I need the flute. Pants flute is going to... So I need... Okay, so flute... Grass or fern? How... how do you get grass? How do I get you guys? I don't understand. Yes, I can burn it. Do I need... Let me try taking shears and just grabbing those. Like, shearing just little shrubs and stuff. Yep, okay. That was easy. Okay, uh, let me turn off the subtitles, actually. Better FPS options, what? This, because this might also help. Uh, make the fog fast. Sure. No, I don't want to restart now. Whoops, okay. But, let's see. Is it video settings where subtitles are? Because that's the one change I remember there being um, to um, between when I made things better and um, not so good in terms of frame rate. Okay. I don't think that's actually going to do anything. Oh, come on, game. Alright. Um. Alright, I need the sugar cane and the grass. Let me put the shears back. Cane, azúcar. Hold on. How? Oh. 
Okay, and now I need to make the drums. Really? You're gonna gonna fall over their planks? that I do actually want to pop outside and maybe kill some things to get their bones okay so I think I also saw that these kind of work like sugar cane maybe yes and that that is hemp so it's not like these where you right click to harvest them you need to punch the top off. Uh, how is my nutrition? Okay, I need more grain and vegetables, which I can figure out later. Okay, I'm pretty good on food right now, so I don't actually need to mess with the farm too much. just destroying the ecosystem over here. Okay, fluid bladder. No, nope, come on. Gotta remember all the... Um, all the different buttons. did that thing where the fluid bladder didn't stay full. Back here, fish. Murdered. Let me get that XP. Flew too close, or swam too close to the sword. Surroundings check, make sure we don't got zombos sneaking up on me. does that. <laughs> Do some people get ASMR from the sound of running water? Should I be talking like this? I'm just being really quiet and kind of close to the mic, at least as close as I can get with this headset and not a real mic. How's that? Is that good for you? What is that face, Lindsay? <laughs> we 
you don't like it when I talk like this? Is that not good for you? more of a reaction than I was expecting, but okay. And it wasn't, that wasn't meant to be the specific you, that was supposed to be the royal you, the general you, the you that is our adoring fans and audience. being melodramatic. <laughs> How dare. Uh, I want to get to age one so that I can get the water basins and not have to do this anymore. The water bladder. But to do that I need to get totems and for that I need the leather and all that stuff which I do have the three leather currently but uh, most totem stuff benefits from having multiple drums. for me to murder. I mean, a creeper is something to murder, but it's not, um, it does not have bones, which is what I want. Really? Why didn't you just swap? Okay. Mm. There's murder in my heart and it must be sated! I see you, skeleton! I need your bones! Nothing. Alright. Is that creeper always there? Did he spawn in? Maybe he came from this cave down here. Get back in your hole! Well, uh, that blew up my chest armor. Maybe I should just like seal this off until I'm ready to do something with it. Yes, the skeleton did have a trumpet because we are in age zero. Uh, there aren't ranged weapons, so they have a trumpet, which does like an AOE pushback effect. Um, also, let's see, what do I have? Protein and vegetable. But what I need is grain and vegetable, which this will give me. Do I have anything that's grain and vegetable? to see if there are things to murder, like that bat. Dropped something, raw bat meat. Hmm. 
Okay. Well, something to look into in the future, but for now. Let's go put all the hide up so it can start drying and become leather and all that good stuff. Like, where'd they go? Let me just double check. Okay, yes. I wonder, other than leather being useful in more things, if there's a reason to use just wet tanned hide for any stuff. Um, Okay, let me make a few more drying racks. how long until this current crafting table is going to break because that's always a fun surprise uh, leaving space next to the chests in case I want to put stuff there okay um, oh. num 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 go into the recipes that are more useful. Okay, I should nom on a wild berry. Just to make sure my fruit stays above 90. make a tasty sandwich out of that. Ale wart bucket. Interesting. Get pork dinner for protein and vegetables. But I guess there's not anything for grain and vegetables. That's a little unfortunate. and leather. Hopefully the oak planks work. A shake, rattle, and roll. Yep, yeah, I have a horse. Um, they are, I'm not sure I'd call them a friend so much as a slave. 
Uh, they're hooked up to this horse grindstone, which I can use to make things. Alright, let me cook. Um, oh. Burb is going doot doot. Uh, emulating the trumpet sounds. Inventory is getting full. Okay, Totempedia. Let me read through this stuff because this is going to tell me how to actually do. Hold it. So, the Totempedia guide to all your totemic needs. So, the basics. Melody is a magical power released from instruments that have been played. Each instrument has a melody threshold, meaning that only a certain amount of melody can be released from one instrument for a specific effect. Maybe in the future, this melody will have functions with other things in the world. Okay. The red cedar tree. The red cedar tree is a tree that naturally has capabilities for totemic purposes. It can be obtained by infusing mundane saplings with musical energy and the rite of spring ceremony. Red cedar wood has the same properties and crafting applications as standard wood. In addition, a bark stripper is able to remove its bark to make more efficient use of its resources. Finally, it can be used to craft certain instruments like the wind chimes or jingle dress. And buffaloes, the mighty buffalo, an animal which is known across the lands for all of the resources it can grant. They are incredibly strong and have a very large amount of health. Hunting has left them nearly extinct, but they can still be created with the buffalo dance ceremony. So before I get into that too much, let me go take a look at the uh, stuff here. So, use the totemic ceremony to spawn buffalo, collect their hide and teeth, collect, uh, consult the totempedia for more info. Uh, then there's a big boss battle, which uh, is going to wreck me if and when I attempt that. So I still need to make a saddle for horses. Uh, wheels on the bus to make a cart. Um, horse chopper and a horse press as well. Uh, sleeping mat. But all that is in an effort to get to the flame grilled whopper, which... Um, I need shark tooth, which I think I have. So I need red cedar plank is the big thing, which is what totems are for, the totempedia stuff. So totems and effects, totem poles. Creating a totem pole is a very simple thing to do. First, you must create a totem whittling knife, which is the tool used to carve a totem pole out of any kind of wood log. The totem knife can carve different patterns of totem poles, which lead to different F effects. Right clicking or scrolling while sneaking will change which pattern will be carved. Excuse me. Totem whittling knife is also needed to carve out the totem base. Each totem pole needs one totem base at the bottom of the pole and can extend six meters high, which I believe just means six blocks. Uh, totem poles will default will by default give beneficial effects to all nearby players. The effects depend on the carving pattern. Uh, <laughs> things are popping off. <laughs> Uh, the effects depend on the carving pattern. The totem pole can have different carvings on different heights. Okay, so the totem woodenly knife, I need... Hopefully not metal. I think I briefly saw that it would work as cobble. Also, just works with flaked flint and a stick. I can do that. Do I have flaked flint? I do not have any sticks on hand. Let me shove food stuff in my backpack. Uh, do I have any hemp anywhere? I do not. What does this get used for? In the millstone to make hemp fibers. Um, let's see, I really don't need hemp right now. Hey! -ya. Okay. Um, let me 
put this back. Put the flick flint back. I'll actually hold on to the sticks. Okay, because I know I also want jingle stuff to make totem stuff easier. So there's jingle dress, which is going to take three jingles and string. Okay, so bone and sugar cane. I can make one jingle, which is not going to be enough. So let me put bones here. Let me get the sugar cane and put it with dumb bones. Dumb bones, dumb bones. And let me go kill things for more bones. Let me also check these. Oh, that is empty, but it's got plenty of shark teeth, which is what I'm going to need eventually. I see you in the distance, skeletal! Two skeletals! I'm coming for you! Give me your bones! Excellent. I don't want to deal with the creepers. Maybe I should get my shears so that I can... Uh, <laughs> make them... Impotent. I think that's the word I'm looking for. sword a little bit. Uh, those cows, I'm eventually going to want to corral and turn them into buffalo. See that zombie in the distance? Gonna go murdering. also recently learned from watching other people play um, that I should be saving the monster flesh for later on rather than turning it into monster jerky. Not that it's particularly hard to come by, but I have enough other sources of meat that I don't need the monster jerky. Okay, that guy definitely just despawned right in front of me. <laughs> you know what I'm referring to. Get in the hall! Mm. Nutrition. Okay, I still need more grain, so I guess we'll go with the tasty sandwich. Jump! Made it. Chest. 
back on and going. Hello, chicken. I haven't ever actually said it, but the reason I'm not spamming my attacks is uh, you see that little bar underneath the crosshair? If I let that charge up, I get to do an AoE sweep attack. Otherwise, uh, it's just a bunch of really weak hits. Give me your bones! Even though I'm wearing the wolf hood, let me just condense these down. Canola. Into canola seeds. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do that. A sharp bone. Looks like it's mostly broken, so let's dump that. Uh, eat up. How's my nutrition? I'm gonna need to eat a wild berry. Let me just throw the fuchsia down on the ground. Nope. Oh, okay, feathers, that's okay. I thought I ran over the sharp bone again. You are a creeper. I do not want to fight with you right now. Come down here and fight me. Let's see, I should repair my sword and a minute. some more berries because those are getting our fruit is getting low enough oh hello cow I guess I should probably get to making the totem stuff. Okay, is it bright enough out that you're a bro now? Yeah, I think he, during the day he's spider bro. Okay. seeds in here. Um, okay. So. So I can put them in there. Okay. Um, I guess I should get to work on totem stuff. That means I need to go get logs.
So apparently, if you just let saplings fall onto dirt and leave them, eventually they will just plant themselves in this uh, mod pack. Give me that apple, though. So, what I need to do is make like one basic oak um, uh, totem pole so that I can perform the Rite of Spring to get the red cedar saplings and then I want to make all my totems out of those in the future. side though to look at the different totem types and effects so I know what exactly it is I'll need to do for the Rite of Spring. Totem effects. Okay. So bat negates fall damage, jump further when you sneak mid-air. Oh, so crouch jumping. <laughs> Fire resistance, buffalo mine faster, cow gives you resistance to damage which slows you down, night vision from the underman, speed boost from the horse, ocelot would be nifty, the pig is probably good, um, maybe spider climbing just so I can climb up my house, okay but none of those seem to be uh, Necessary for the Rite of Spring. Okay, uh, Rite of Spring is the one of the many growth and fertility ceremonies um, available to a totemist. After activating, all nearby animals will sequentially proceed to breed. Along with that, any nearby saplings will transform into <laughs> red cedar saplings. <laughs> yes, there are ocelots. Lover, I don't have to love. Okay, so I need the flute and a drum. Basics of ceremonies. I should probably read these first. Ceremonies are a way for a totemist to, gra to gather strength over a period of time through the power of melody to release a central burst of energy on both players and the nearby world. The center of the ceremony is a totem base, and it is also, and it also is where the effects of a ceremony are released from. Ceremonies are powered by the melody that is released from instruments when they are played. There are two main points in the ceremony, the first being selection, and the second being the ceremony effects. Selecting ceremonies. In order to select which ceremony you wish to activate, a specific task must be complete. Excuse me. Uh, any instruments played while sneaking will play in their selector mode and will not release any melody as they would normally. A combination of two instruments in selector mode will start a ceremony depending on which were played. For example, using the flute in selector mode twice will activate the Serenade of the Depths. And a blank page. Foreign ceremonies, once the ceremony has been selected, the startup will initiate. While it is in this stage, the totem pole will accept any played melody and store it. In order for a ceremony to activate, a certain amount of melody is required depending on how difficult the ceremony is. This difficulty is represented by how many notes there are in, the, in its entry in this book. When the melody requirement for the ceremony is reached, it will activate. Each instrument can only be played up to a certain point, meaning the ceremony could not be played with just one instrument. This is known as the melody threshold. Any smoke that emits from the totem base will signify that the most recently played instrument has reached its melody threshold for that ceremony. And the user should stop using that specific instrument for the rest of the ceremony. Additionally, there is a limited amount of time to complete the ceremony, meaning playing speed is important. After you've created enough melody, the ceremony will begin for forefront begin performing its effects. Some ceremonies have instant effects, others will last over a certain amount of time after the effect initially starts. It should be known that the effects can only pertain for a certain amount of time and will stop after that time has elapsed. Finally, there should be care taken with the timing between instruments in order to complete the ceremony efficiently. A rhythm between instruments may be important. Because of that, it is recommended that a totemist spend some time getting used to the rhythms of certain instruments. So, again, not just slamming on instruments. Okay, so I'm gonna want the flute and the drums okay so the TP comes from totemus stuff
Mars in open sky to be used? I don't think so, because I've clearly... Um, the totem torch is simply a larger, more decorative version of a regular torch. Uh, yeah, no, that's not... Okay. Um, okay, 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 okay. Let's go ahead and just set up like a totem area. Um, no, we'll leave those for now. I do actually want to grab the saplings that I just have chilling in here. <laughs> okay, maybe I'm not going to put down 64 saplings, but... I should probably actually get a printout somewhere that I can just refer to for the effects. Um, buffalo would be good. Um, horse would be good. Ocelot. Pig. Okay, so um, buffalo, horse, ocelot, pig. Ocelot, horse, pig. And the order should not matter. Well, well they're going to be facing different directions, but that's fine. Oh, come on. Why you do that game? So you see now I have luck, spider, speed, and haste. So I can just climb up this because of the spider. And I move a little bit faster. And mining also goes a teensy bit faster. Okay. have this in my offhand if I'm trying to place the chimes. Which how how I place the chimes. Okay, so the chimes do need to stay attached to an overhang. gonna go sleep overnight so that um, okay and I'm too far away from the totem here to get any of those effects Uh, 
heard monsters dying. I think he dropped his trumpet. He did. <laughs> okay, we will mess with that later. Unfamiliar item. Um, I should plant a whole bunch of saplings around. Okay, so yeah, here is still close enough. Here is not. Okay. Ceremonies, basic ceremonies. Selecting. Okay, so flute twice for serenade of the deaths. Okay, so what I want to do for Rite of Spring then is flute, then drum while in sneak. too close to each other. Wait, nope. Nope, okay. Sorry. Need to do that again, or let this play out. Trying that again. Now look at all these saplings that become red cedar. Okay, so I need to let those grow. Okay, these ones were outside the range. But that one wasn't. Interesting. Okay. Well, I guess I just need those to go now. for a lot of different things. Flint handsaw.
just wondering what could I be using these for? Okay, I could make so many torches, which I think I'm going to want to do. So, this is about to be very boring while I make a bajillion torches. I apologize. Um, give me them sticks. <laughs> okay, how many is that actually? <laughs> Only eleven. to light all these suckers. And now it's these plus stick for the totem torches. Wait, is it two sticks? that was going to happen sooner or later, and yet it's still always a surprise. those down. Okay, really, what, what can I use for these? Okay, and what does a shaft go into? Okay, it's just... <laughs> uh, does it make these more durable? What What is the point of a shaft over a stick? Get the hand crank. I need to make for the millstone. Okay, that's what you need buffalo teeth for. I'm hearing noises, RL. Um, okay, let me just go ahead and put all these back. go check on the cedar trees. I don't really have anything for you to be doing right now, horse. Uh, let me put rotten flesh away, because I'm going to be holding on to that. Do I have flint chilling anywhere? Not really.
Okay, yeah, that looks like that looks like something happened. Okay, now if I chop down some of these other saplings, it will hopefully let the others grow. see down into that cave a little Hello, sir. What is all that? Terra clay clump. Which may come in handy later on. Okay, we're not gonna fight that current. my nutrition. Uh, let me eat some veggies. Want some of this? spider climb, I can just come up to the top of the tree <laughs> and chop down. I see you down there, Zombo. Yeah, what, what you gonna do? See if Ocelot works. Okay. No, that still blew up. Did I not make an Ocelot? 
Spider pig. What are you? Aren't you ocelot? And yeah, so yeah, it is an ocelot, and ocelots are supposed to keep creepers from blowing up. Terracotta bricks, which get used in I don't know what. Probably not a ton that I can do with them right now. Okay, those are the planks, that's the wood. Okay, um. Alright, I have enough of this now. that I can probably make the flame grilled hopper and turn it into a melter and eventually I'll come back for those and I know there was the thing that said I can make um, that the red cedar bark is useful, but given my limited storage capacity right now and the ease with which I can make the red cedar, I'm not going to worry about that right now. Charcoal dust. All oh, right, that's that's why I need the buffalo because I need to. Oh, jeez. Okay. Because I need the charcoal dust. Okay, 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 okay. Hmm. I think it's time for me to make another chest um, let's see these each make 12 or a whole 12 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 okay so the advanced primal chest holds more advanced primal chest which is a primal chest with enough bark so so that's just planks with the dark oak planks Okay, so first I need to make plain old chest. Let me get bark ready. planks. Now I need these planks. This is just where I'm going to put a whole bunch of wood stuff and totem stuff. And sure, that's where I'll put saplings. Okay, let me go ahead and put the terracotta clay clump here with the rest of that stuff. 
Um, I just break this on something quickly. those trees. Okay, so what I need to do now is get cows. Um, let me just throw these down, see if they'll plant themselves. Okay, can I make just like a fence yet? Nope. But I can make stone walls. Okay, so I need to go dig up a bunch of cobblestone. close enough for those. Actually, does it make sense for me to replace those with the um, with red cedar? I should probably get the totempedia so that I can see which ones I want. That's just destroying them, which is unfortunate, but it was just oak wood, no huge loss. turn this into a spider next so that I can just climb up. Okay, now I want... Um, ocelot. Oh, I wanted the pig. still so it still seems to have the same range I don't know okay but I need to take so much cobblestone and turn it into walls Close enough 
to get the benefit of the buffalo for digging faster. chop these down. But the saplings that there are um, because what I'm thinking, I never completed the thought out loud, is setting up a cow paddock over here rather than said making a whole new set of instruments or you're moving them and stuff but just chop down these trees and that way I can uh, make use of my same totem setup tools <laughs> just slapping on another stone to each of them <laughs> Climb. Oh, I must be out of range of the totem. Up. Oh. All right, where is the tree? Okay, that's some interesting leaf growth patterns. get exactly, well, I uh, had part of a stack before, but did I really finish up with a full stack of the cedar wood? Okay, so these are just six each. What is there's no difference between these. What?
I suppose I could also just make a teeny tiny paddock. Oh, well, no, okay, that made a lot more. It was making more walls. I assumed it was six stone per wall, but nope. Okay. Well then. Uh, let's sleep. Come at me, bro! Lots of armored zombies. That it? We done? Okay. Combine these, free up inventory space. Which, while I'm thinking about it, I should do that with all my leather gear. Definitely wasting a bit of the durability on these, but that's okay. Let me eat a well, let me eat the apple. Yes. So actually. Industrial fermenter, okay. <laughs> I think I'm a bit away from being able to do that, whatever it is. Um, why'd I put my leather there? Whatever. Cedar sapling that's ready to go, but um, let's go ahead and pop the rest of these out because they seem disinclined to grow for whatever reason. should be plenty close enough. So, I should be able to get in and out of these easily enough with the spider climb. No. 
I do want it to go there. Have a little bit of wiggle room. find some cows. Weren't there normally a whole bunch of cows just chilling over here? There are horses, but horses aren't cows. I see you, cow! You are mine, cow! I love this being able to pick things up thing. Oh, nearly jumped into the hole. Whoops. Oh boy. It's not letting me... Okay. Well, this is why you look where you're going and don't get distracted with Discord. Um, don't go anywhere, cow. Okay, coming back for the other cow. You will have friends, I promise you. Just trying to capture all the cows I can right now. Silly of me to engage, but it's fine. Maybe I'll capture chickens too, <laughs> just to have them. that I could take so that I can cap so that I can lead more at once. I'm just looking for wheat on the ground. So, so many cows. I don't want to carry them all one at a time. Hey. Oh, cows. Stampede! Mm. 
This is so much better than one at a time carrying. Oh no, you don't. Come on, you jerks. Welcome to your new home. Do I want to breed them first before turning them into mm. buffalo, or just turn them into buffalo and then breed the buffalo? because I know that will be useful and also so that I can use up the six planks I just happened to have. Let's do Rite of Spring. Okay, nope. We're abandoning the Rite of Spring until morning. Look at all the cows. <laughs> this is this is obscene. I feel like I need to turn on the mature settings filter for this. Look at all the baby cows. Okay, I don't know that all of them at the ceremony. Alright, I put the totem PDO away. Come on. Okay. Ceremonies, buffalo dance. Drum and wind chimes.
is going to be interesting. Nearly had it. Just barely missed it. No, come on. If I weren't messing up. Okay, I think I got this. There we go. Look at them turn into the buffalo. It only turned a couple of them into buffalo. Interesting. Let me try that again. I think it turned a few more of them into buffalo. And those are baby buffalo. Okay. Um. Just having them go at it, and then I think I will let nature take its course for a bit. for a buffalo to grow up before I slaughter it for its teeth. So what can I do in the meantime? I could make the saddle, I could make the horse cart stuff, I could make the sleeping mat. Let's see, sleeping mat. Thatch thin slab. Which Thatching. Okay, so it's time to make use of all that thatch reed stuff.
four of those together. And now I just go place this outside. And it turns into eventually eventually that dries out I just put my instruments away right uh, let me go gather more sugar cane because I know I'm gonna need that Buffalo. Do you also want wheat? <laughs> what do I want to do right now? I mean, obviously, the smart thing to do would be to make. Um, the saddle and those things but I think I'm gonna wrap up soon here and so I don't want to get too involved in anything to spread them out. Hey, one is dried. thatching into thatch. Sneak click to pick up. Slats provide extra support for what? Okay, and I need the thin slab. Thin thatch slabs on the chopping block. Okay. So that's I'm gonna need to make one of the buffalo into a thing. I need to make the horse chopping block, make room for it, and all that fun stuff. Here, <laughs> so that you can feel useful. Um, drop things off. Oh, limestone must have been from a creeper explosion. How's my nutrition? Okay. Most things are pretty good, it's just the vegetables that are pretty low. Um, anyway. Oh, already done, are you? the rest of the salt and stuff go. Did I really use up all of it when making stuff the last time? Okay. Um, 
so yeah. I think that's going to be it for now. Gonna take a break. Well, I say break. Uh, who knows if I'll come back and stream stuff later, but need to step away from the computer for a bit for today. Get some fresh air or something. So, that was some more SevTech Minecraft. Um, hopefully next time I will actually get through to the next age. I know this one was a little bit of a short one. But, yeah. Um, follow us here on Twitch. Uh, follow us on Twitter. Uh, on YouTube. Good Game Nights. 2Gs with a K. Um, you'll see all our scheduled stuff. But you'll also be kept informed of when we do impromptu, uh, especially video game streams like this. Uh, come join our Discord. It's free and open, though there are special benefits if you are a Twitch subscriber, like being able to play D&D with us. Um, yeah, that's it. Um, good game and a good night, Internet.